I'm Robert Wilson, Senior Director of Cybersecurity Engineering. I'm going to attempt to talk you through a few of the basic principles behind running AppGuard solo. It's a little different than traditional antivirus, and thus the video. To get to your AppGuard, this assumes, of course, that you've already installed AppGuard. It's on the hidden icons, and here's our AppGuard. You'll see that it's got three states, protected, allow installs, and often unprotected. Protected is the normal way that we recommend having this run. We're going to attempt to install this program, just so happens called FileZilla, without turning off protections. You'll see you already get a pop-up that says that it's being protected and this application cannot install or run. This is because AppGuard protects the desktops and your downloads and all the rest of the places that malware tends to congregate and it stops that from running. So if I really want to install this application, assuming that it isn't just a random pop-up, obviously if this pops up during the day, you just ignore it. But I'm going to turn up my now installs. You'll notice that the resume protected level will happen after 20 minutes, and now I'm going to install FileZilla again. Yes, I'm going to allow this. I'm just going to read it on me. So as you can see, this is installing as per a normal application would. I'm going to finish this. Obviously, some of the bundleware there didn't like it. Here is my FileZilla up and running. My protection level, I'm going to turn back up to normal. However, if now I want to have FileZilla run normally on my laptop, but I don't completely trust it, I don't want it running anything that I don't first approve, I want it to perform in its normal system parameters but not do anything outside, I could then guard this application. I do this by hitting the Customize button. I go to Guarded Applications. I'm going to Add a Program. And you can see it's already found FileZilla. It's found all these different applications on my machine that I could select and say, yes, I want to run. But I'm going to show you what happens if you don't see it there. So I'm going to Windows, Program Files, FileZilla. There's the same application. I'm going to add it. And now you can see that FileZilla is there at the top. And we hit OK. That is pretty much all there is to this. Should you wish for further information, there's a help button here, which will bring up a context-sensitive help screen, which will tell you more information on some of the other features I did not just show you. And if you get really stuck, here if we do help about, you will see here is the tech support email. Feel free to email us and ask for support. Just make sure to include your license ID and your activation email. I hope you found this of use and enjoy AppGuard Solo. Thank you so much.